It's another lovely day today here at Mills Motors in Oshawa, located at 240 Bond Street East. Right now we're taking a look at a 2017 GMC Terrain SLE2 all-wheel drive with the Quicksilver metallic exterior. And this vehicle has a 2.4 liter dock direct injection four-cylinder engine with six-speed automatic transmission. Let's take a look inside. And here's just a quick overview of the interior area of the vehicle before I take you through some of its features. To quick look and firstly I'm going to mention the driver's adjustable seat right here with lumbar support and then on the driver's side door you have the Pioneer speakers which are part of the premium audio system. Alright so I'll climb inside and show you the tech features starting with the IntelliLink screen in the center here so it is a full color touch screen so you've got your radio options plenty of music streaming options you've got Sirius XM AM and FM radio and then you can stream via Bluetooth you can stream via USB or you can stream via um, an audio auxiliary outlet as well phone is compatible with Bluetooth and you can uh, hook up your phone so you can take advantage of the hands-free voice command options and again, USB and uh, audio auxiliary outlets, as well as on this screen, you can see Bluetooth, and then you've got uh, different uh, settings on that side. So again, it is a uh, touch screen, but you can also use these buttons down here to control it. And then you have your uh, radio presets right there as well. Moving down farther, you do have your hazards right here, and then underneath you have the AC, as well as the uh, different climate settings, and then you have uh, heated and cooled seats for driver and passenger. If you take a look just down here, this is controlling the driver's information center, which is in front of us, uh, in front of the steering column. So if you go through the different menu options, oh, the vehicle's not on. If you go through the different menu options, you can scroll up and down through these buttons, or you can take a look at your uh, vehicle's information. So it's kind of ex easily accessible, just right there. And if you move down further, there's some storage space mode. down here, and, and there is a power outlet in the back there. Moving along, eco mode is activated right here. Got two cup holders and then traction control just right here. Then this leather app center console, if you take a look inside, you have a little removable cargo storage area. And then down here further, you have USB and audio auxiliary outlets. If we move along to the... Uh, Steering wheel, you can see that on the right hand side you have your hands free voice command options as well as your stereo options. So you can change the stereo there. And then on this side, you have your cruise control options. If we move up top here, the rearview mirror has the OnStar buttons, which are equipped to help you stay safe and connected while on the road. And then up top, we do have a sunroof. So it is a full tilt and sliding sunroof. So if you want to slide it backwards, you got that option. And then if you just want a little bit of fresh air, you can tilt it up at the back for days where it's not the greatest, but it's still nice out. The cloth upholstery seating, as well as the driver's door and passenger door do have power locks and power windows. Take a look at the glove box. And then I'm going to show you the driver's side door as the last little bit. You've got power windows, your power mirrors, power locks, and again, the Pioneer sound system on the door. And here's a quick look at the driver's side exterior of the vehicle and then I'm going to show you uh, the cargo space that is available in the rear. So if you take a look down here, we do have the 18 inch aluminum wheels. And then yeah, so let's go take a look at the cargo area that is available in this vehicle. So you've got your trunk right here, you have the full color backup camera. It's just right here. All right, so I'm gonna open it up and show you around inside. So the first thing you'll notice is there is a cargo cover right here and it is retractable and completely removable. So if you just pull on it like that, it stows itself away in that nifty little thing. And then you can remove it completely by unlatching it at the back here. Super easy. All right, so here is the cargo area that is available in all of its glory. It is very spacious for such a mid-size um, compact vehicle, which is really nice. And then you do have a power outlet back here and you have storage space on the top of both sides as well as speaker back here uh, cargo tie down hooks along these sides and then down here you have the compact spare tire these seats do collapse as well to expand the cargo area even further and then if you take a look up top there is a little handle to help you lower the trunk 
And then here's a look at the full passenger side of the vehicle as well. So now we'll take a look at the rear passenger area of the vehicle. There's a cup holder in the side door as well as plenty of storage space. And then if you take a look, the rear of the front driver's and passenger seats do have cargo nets for storage. Overview of the seating area. It is pretty spacious for your passengers as well as the seats do slide forward and backwards along a track to expand uh, the area that's available. There is a drop down center armrest right here with some cup holders for your passengers and then there is a power outlet just in the center here for charging. Like I mentioned these seats do collapse forward and they're done so pretty easily. So you just fold this up like that and swing the seats down and they fold down flat and you can expand the cargo area quite a lot and you can fit plenty of items back here. Super easily done. I had one hand on the camera the whole time and there's the rear area. And there's your final look at the 2017 GMC Terrain SLE 2 all-wheel drive in the Quicksilver metallic exterior. And this vehicle is equipped with the safety and connectivity of OnStar with its own 4G LTE Wi-Fi network. And if you'd like to take a look at this vehicle and go take it for a test drive, come on down to Mills Motors in Oshawa, located at 240 Bond Street East, where we'll do whatever it takes.